Hello guys, welcome to another installment of the Review Detective. In today's episode, we're gonna take a look at Dell's budget 2-in-1 laptop called the Inspiron 13 5000, which is a neat little package for the price of 549 Canadian dollars. And while this laptop comes in different configurations, we have here the low-end version which comes with an i3 processor, 4GB of RAM and a 500GB HDD. The laptop comes with a Full HD glossy touch screen which is not ideal but can look very good under the right conditions. The laptop has a great design and might even be able to fool some people that it is a much more expensive device, especially since the plastic chassis is made to look like brushed aluminum. Dell has been able to fit all the internals in just under 21mm thick body which feels of comparable thickness to even some ultrabooks, though it still can't quite compete with those in the weight category. In the input and output department, what is provided here will probably be enough for most students or casual users. We have one USB 2 port and an SD card slot on one side and two USB 3 ports and an HDMI port on the other side which are positioned right next to the headphone jack. Unfortunately there is no USB C port but it is nice to have three USB A ports which will still allow you to plug multiple devices without the need of a hub or a dongle. The laptop has a nicely sized plastic touchpad which works very smoothly and is almost comparable in performance to the XPS 13. The keyboard is shallower than a desktop computer keyboard but not too shallow to make it uncomfortable to use. Under normal usage, such as using Microsoft Word, browsing the web and watching the occasional video on YouTube or Netflix, we have been able to consistently get about 6-7 to seven hours of battery life, though your mileage may vary depending on the type of work that you do. In order to earn the 2-in-1 title, Dell has designed the laptop with hinges which allow it to be folded and used as a tablet. The hinges allow multiple other ways that you can use the laptop. Fold it into tent mode to watch movies or simply fold the keyboard backwards to allow for better ventilation while using the touchscreen in bed. Even though this is the low spec model of the Dell Inspiron, we have found that it works quite smoothly and with few hiccups on the regular usage of typing, writing in Word or watching YouTube videos in HD. Having all these features in such a flexible package and for under $600 makes this laptop perfect for casual users or students that need a portable laptop that can be used for their studies or for taking notes in class. So we hope this review is helpful in deciding whether this laptop is right for you and if you have any questions or suggestions about how we can improve in the future, feel free to leave a comment below. Otherwise, feel free to leave a thumbs up or a thumbs down and of course subscribe if you want to see more great content from the review detective.